today i'll read from first corinthians chapter 12 verse 12 and we'll discuss uh, uh, the, on the topic of body of life or body of christ like uh, how important the body is for all of us in our marriages or raising up kids and and friendship and that uh, how we get that uh, nourishment in the body and and this body is not only made of uh, the people but it's like uh, came out of Jesus Christ and it's like Jesus Christ is the head of this body that's why this body has a very uh, spiritual and very important meaning uh, for all of us when we uh, when we are in, in the body so like uh, verse 12 says for as the body is one and has many members but all the members of one body being many are one body also also is Christ for by one spirit we were all baptized into one body whether Jewish or Greeks whether slaves or free have all been made to drink into one spirit for in fact the body is not one member but many body is not one member but many members body is made of out of many members uh, so each and every member is very uh, important like nobody can say that I am not important or it's not needed uh, they are there it's enough uh, no it's all all are counted all are important all members make into one body and and great thing is that we are baptized into one body by the Holy Spirit it's not by our strength it's not because of uh, human being wisdom it was because of spirit who uh, baptism of spirit which immersed us into the body of Christ so uh, thank be to God that we we are the part of a body of Christ because of a Holy Spirit who we are who we are uh, baptized by and and you look at uh, Acts chapter 2 uh, you see that the beginning of the church how uh, it came out of the spirit at the day of Pentecost how the church started and and uh, you can see through that of chapter 2 that the revival began from the Acts chapter 2 and how church were like uh, verse 46 chapter 2 verse 46 in Acts chapter 2 so continuing continuing daily with one accord in the temple they were in one accord many members but one accord unity and there was a diverse diversity and breaking bread from house to house they are they ate their food with gladness and simplicity of heart uh, praising god and having favor with all the people and the lord added to the church daily those who were being saved so what a gift uh, god gives to that uh, church when when we are in one accord breaking bread daily uh, in a sense if we have a Bible classes we have Bible college we have fellowship with one another uh, maybe a heart to heart fellowship in spirit we have a fellowship fellowship not like not like having one one kind of group group but its body is made of different members it's not just one section but one group or one one people it's like many members and and no one can say that say that i don't need you or i i am not needed nobody can say that because all all have the importance in the body of christ so when we keep that thing in our mind like in one accord when we pray when we think about each other lord adds to the church and god blesses each and our, each and every one of our life uh, because because of the spirit work uh, in the body of Christ and uh, and remember in Revelation you see that how spirit speak to the church and and to the church we we are blessed we uh, the messages are blessed personal personal life in our personal life God speak to the church and uh, and it, we carry it into our uh, personal life and we are in our private life and personal life we carry that message everywhere uh, we go because spirit works in the church and God is building the church uh, Christ is building the church so church is a body of Christ and we never neglect uh, this uh, special group of people which are which are holy nation and which are holy people saved by grace called out of uh, Gentile called out of 
darkness and we are into the light church is kind of light tower body of christ is kind of an example to the surrounding uh, we love one another and people see the christ in us so yeah so let us not stop again gathering together and uh, let's let's uh, think about this amen have a good day